Hey, I'm Tricelle. Welcome back to my channel. I'm an adult dog collector. I love all things 1-6 scale. So today I am going to be reviewing the Barbie Extra Fancy doll with the pink dress. I did win her on eBay and now my collection is complete. And I won her for $20 so I'm really impressed with that. Alright, so I am going to get her out of this packaging so we can have a closer look. Here she is right out of the packaging. She has a long ponytail with crunchy bangs that has product in it. She does have two chokers and a metallic chain that says extra and a long metallic necklace that's gold in color. I do like all of her jewelry pieces. And I really love that her earrings are metallic gold. Um, she does also have this mirror with pearls as for a handle. She has pearls as a bracelet one of my favorite pieces is this perfume um, handbag that she has I love it she also has these pearl glasses and a pearl headband and her dress which is a faux pink patent leather outfit she also has heart stockings i love the bows on this dress and the train is detachable and i love her pink heels as well here she is without the train i absolutely love this garment the hot pink the stockings the bows i love this and here it is in the back it does velcro And I almost forgot her pink poodle with star glasses. This doll is articulated. Her head moves up and down, side to side. She does have um, arm movement at the shoulder. She has an elbow joint. Her wrists move. She has the standard hip movement. And she also has a knee joint. So I did buy the Barbie Ultimate Closet during, um, after Christmas. It was on sale for like $9.99 or something like that. So I picked this up. So I'm going to get it out of the packaging so we can have a closer look. Here it is out of the packaging. It is purple and hot pink on the outside. And it is it has durable plastic. And it does have a handle for um, it being portable and easy storage. So this closet did come with the doll with the basic articulation. It is a Barbie. And she does have on a dress with cutouts, that stripe, and these white heels, which are really cute. I do like the cutouts and it doesn't have any Velcro, so it does have a smooth look. So let's open up this closet and it does have some accessories with a couple of pieces in it. I'm going to open that up so we can have a closer look to see what we're going to get today. Here is a dress and a romper. We also get a necklace. So we have this pink clutch bag along with these black heels, these teal heels. We also have this black purse. We have a white necklace and hangers. So I'm going to have my fashionista try on the romper here. It is black and pink. It is super cute. It does Velcro in the back. And I did pair this with the black boots So here is my fashionista in the floral sundress. It does Velcro in the back. And I also did pair this dress with the teal heels. And I do think this is really pretty. So I did put the dress that came with the doll with the closet on a made to move body, the fashionista. So you'll see how it looks and I had absolutely no problem getting the doll into this garment it looks amazing
And per usual, I am going to open up the Mini Brands Fashion Series 3 with the 80 iconic pieces that has the shoes. Every time I unbox a closet, I feel like I need to be adding um, some Mini Brands to it. So let me just get this open and then we're, we'll see what we got. All right, so we have the collector's guide and there are a few purses that I still would like to get. Um, I would like that one. I'll take that one there. Those, of course, any shoes. The lipstick would be nice. And I would not mind getting um, some of the, the boots, like the red ones or the tan ones. Okay, so in the first bag, oh, okay. I, this is not a double, this is a new purse for me. It is black and it has chains, it's super cute. It has a working zipper. Okay, that was a good one. So let's open up the next bag and see what we're gonna get. Oh, and we got some boots another new one for me hmm and then we also have here a silver color bracelet and then the gold earrings which is not new for me here is how the boots look on my classic made to move barbie doll and it looks really good so i did get this mold on amazon it's a purse mold miniature purse mold and it does have designers inside of the mold, like Louis Vuitton, Chanel, Hermes. And I'm going to use my hot glue gun and I am going to fill it up, paint it, and then decorate it and see if I can make my own little miniature purse. did purchase these nail charms on AliExpress a couple of years ago. I do my own nails, so I purchased them to decorate my nails, but I am going to use them on the handbag. And here is how it looks, all painted and decorated. I mean, not too bad <laughs> for our own little designer miniature handbag. So today we made our own designer miniature handbag. We also reviewed some mini brands and a dream closet along with the pretty iconic pink little dress from our Barbie Extra Fancy doll. Thank you so much for joining me today. If you did enjoy the video, please give me a big thumbs up. I would really appreciate it. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Don't forget to ring the bell. You guys are all amazing. I so appreciate you so, so much. Have a wonderful day and thank you. Bye.